it's humid, hot, sticky chickens. <laughs> Tipsy's panting. It's really cool over there on the other side of the shed, underneath the trees. I'm glad they hang out there. That's where they're heading. The ducks will be excited for some fresh clean water. I get the rake and rake the wood chips up so they have a ramp. Starting to make their way over here. Move Tipsy to the coolest spot in the barnyard. Not too bad. Deep shade. See the sunline. I did rake up the chips so the ducks could get into the pond more easily. Looks like they're more interested in the spot where I rake the chips from. They're nosing around. Ten day forecast, um, the very end of it, it cools off again. So a good long week of it, plus a day or two. Week from Monday, let's say Sunday, tomorrow's Monday. Week from Monday, it'll start cooling off again. This poor little chicken doesn't have a name. She's a winter baby. Where's the other winter baby? Have you seen Chip? Seen Chip anywhere? Gonna take him a little bit to cool off. Yeah, I just brought him into the landing. There's an air conditioning vent at the bottom of the stairs. I'll leave the door open for a while because there's a big vent in the hallway. It'll cool off. It's a little filtered sun coming through here, but it's pretty. It's significantly cooler in this corner of the yard because there's multiple trees. There's a lot of trees. A lot of berries on this tree. Yeah, what a mess. So that's my compost area. It's full at the moment. I'm thinking about getting a chipper. We've been looking at them, pricing them. I don't like the prices of the good ones, but, you know, that's what I would need. I would need a good one. He's looking for a grape. There's some really nice looking grapes. We really trimmed that grapevine back 
severely this year, like kept up on it. So they can't reach the grapes this year. They'll jump for them. They're so cute when you're jumping for berries or grapes. <laughs>